All right, we're out at Peter's again. Water is clear from Tropical Storm Cristobal. Got a new thing. It's a Mako Flasher. Basically, you throw it and fish get attracted to it. So let's see if that even works. So I'm sitting out in a rock and I was like, just missed missed a big grouper. I'll get this sucker out. There you go. Alright. One in the box. Did you get that black bass or too small? If I keep, if I keep uh, missing shots, shoot.
Nice. I'm not even, I'm trying to get jumped in and she's over here already slaying.
we saw a small Kobe on the Stingray. Um, definitely wasn't legal, but that was a pretty cool scene. Um, he swam by very early um, when we were first anchoring, and I was actually amazed we'd see, we saw it, or I saw it again. But, um, so no Cobia. Saw a couple grouper. I missed them on the holes that you probably saw. Um, one of them had, just had his tail sticking out. And um, I was sort of trying to see how real big it was before just shooting blindly and having a legal size grouper. And by the time how I realized how big he was, I shot, and I guess I shot under, under him when he was taking off and didn't get him. Um, I don't know if I got the footage. I'm, I'll be. You know, I'm filming this after I have really looked at all the stuff, but um, I I caught a I, caught, I found a hogfish. Uh, he was probably I don't know, probably like that big, that, that big around. Um, it's just a little baby one swimming around in less than four feet of water up in St. Marks. You know, that's pretty rare, pretty unheard of. Um, I've seen them some years ago, but I haven't seen them six years or so so that's kind of cool seeing them come back um, I've never seen a big one a big enough one to shoot out there I've always just seen babies which sort of shows you you know it's a it's a nursery ground for a lot of different species which is pretty cool um, but uh, I don't know maybe the big ones come in there and spawn and um, they sort of grow up there and the big ones leave I don't know I've never been able to find a big enough one to shoot um, but it's definitely cool seeing baby hogfish swimming around this far up north and instead of down in the Keys and, uh, you know, Boca and Atlantic, Atlantic side, you know, like Tampa, I guess you get them in Tampa too, but, um, yeah, everyone I tell about the hogfish up here, they're like, there's no hogfish up here, but there definitely is some, you just gotta look for them, and they're very tiny, and they're just babies, so you gotta let them babies grow, and you gotta let them get big, and maybe one day you might be able to shoot one, catch one on a little shrimp or little gold black Carly uses um, but yeah uh, that was my family in the video my sister's in town with her kids um, you probably have there's probably some slow-mo videos of that but yep um, we're gonna go have some dinner and uh, hit the river tomorrow and relax so till next time uh, like comment and subscribe to this channel it'll help me out um, trying to get the uh, YouTube algorithm working and uh, yeah, it keeps the support up and makes me want to make more videos when, when more and more people subscribe. I think we're up to 132 people, which is more than I ever thought I would get. So yeah, till next time.